What's up, Pat? Yo, you ready, man? Oh, it's tonight, isn't it? You forgot, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, sorry, man. I'm already hungover as shit and I'm in bed, so I'm not going out tonight. Yeah, I kind of figured... What the hell happened here? It's like New Jersey after Hurricane Irene. Yeah, thanks for noticing. What is that smell, man? Open a window or something. <sighs> sure thing, Mom. I'm just being honest, man. Here. Oh. What the hell is that? You look like you got Chia Pet glued onto your face. Take care of that. Take a shower. We gotta get out of here. Dude, look, I'm not going, right? I haven't left the house since the whole jazz thing. And I feel like I haven't showered in like months. And honestly, I just keep drinking to keep the hangover from coming back. No, it's kind of the point of this whole thing. It's pretty clear. <sighs> Take the razor. No. Shave the mess off. I'm not going. You know how many lies I had to tell Mary to get her to agree to this? It's I'm her not sister. Going. Shut up. You're going. No. <laughs> I'm not sleeping on the couch tonight. Come on. You're going. Come on. No, no, no. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. 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 All right. Fine. 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 Okay. All right. All right. Come on. No. No. Bye. At least you're lucky she likes blind dates. I fucking hate blind dates, Mary, and you know I hate blind dates. God, I just got out of a relationship with Paul, so I come to New York for sisterly help, and all I've gotten is you and Patrick keeping me up all night, and now you're putting me on a blind date with Patrick's friend who apparently drinks more than Crazy Uncle Frank. Cool your fucking tits, Rose. You'll love this guy, okay? He's cute, he's honest, and the best part, he's single. Alright, Tom! Looking good! Let's get moving. Mm -mm. Look, man, you just don't get it. Alright? You've never been dumped by someone that you were in love with before. Like, seriously, she was the one, dude. She was perfect. You know, she was fun, and, and funny, and smart, and the fact that she happened to be sexy was just a bonus. Okay. That's enough. Okay. That. Fuck, man, I'm drinking that. You were letting this bitch turn you into Charlie freaking Sheen, man. But what did you mean by that bitch? Are we really gonna have to do this right now? Well, yeah, if you've got a problem with it, then yes. <sighs> okay. The moment I met Jazz, I always thought she was... immature. Hmm. Okay, you can stop right there. What kind of is Jazz anyway? What's she, 19 year old stripper? All right, I I'm warning you now. She was always controlling you. Do I seriously have to remind you of this? The way she would lead you around like you were on a leash and you were a little monkey boy? Shut the fuck up! Tom, you deserved better. <laughs> oh. Ow, what the fuck, man? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Fucker, you punched me in the eye! Are you okay? No, I'm not okay! You just hit me in the oh. face! I'm so, just, just let me see it. It can't be god that bad. Damn. It, can't, it really can't be that bad, just let me see it. Oh, oh fuck, is it bad? Ooh! Oh, uh, no. Oh my god. How did it ever cross your mind that I'm interested in alcoholic men? Gee, tits, I don't know. Maybe it's the fact that you broke into my boyfriend's liquor cabinet that we now have to lock, because if we didn't, you would just drink your ass and death. <laughs> I would not. Sure you would. You're not called, Rose. I am not. Does that not answer your question? Who are you to judge? You've been drinking all day too. Yeah, not to drown in my sorrow. It's just hard, Em. I mean, I was with Paul for four years, and then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, he just dumps me. By text. I know he's such an ass for that. Excuse me? Tits. In all honesty, he was a bit of a douche. Excuse me? Mom and I would talk shit about him behind your back. Oh my god, Em, you are not fucking saying this right now. And the way that he would kiss up to dad all the time, please, can you spell pathetic? 
We all thought you deserved way better. Ow, what the fuck, Rose? What'd you do that for? You were such a bitch. Okay, I'm a bitch? Let's backtrack for a second. You come to my apartment unannounced and uninvited just to simply tell me that Paul broke up with you. So I think to myself, why don't I ask Pat to see if he has a friend that could double with my beautiful little sister. My sister who needs to get over her lame of an ass ex-boyfriend. You think I'm a bitch? A bitch. I'm sorry. Oh yeah? Jesus. Do I look pretty? Yeah. <laughs> look, it's just... I loved her. And she just left. She didn't call me, she didn't text me, she just... showed up, took all her shit, and that was it. That sucks, man. Really sucks. But you gotta get out. You're not gonna get over her getting hammered in your room. She's nice. She's cool. You'll like her. What's the worst that could happen? No, yeah, you're right. I've been spending too much time here anyway. Of course I'm right. Go get me a fucking ice pack. Alright, hold on. <laughs> you're fat. Shut up. Yeah, I know. It's kind of unhealthy, you know? A little bit. <laughs> Ready? Yeah, that's one way to do it. Some more liquor. <laughs> yeah, I've been drinking. Oh yeah, I met Nick at his bar and he was insulting me. Like a cup of that shit. Bullshit. Sorry for loving you. So this, the man himself, Tom. Tom Richards. Mary Monroe. Nice to meet you, Mary. So where's Rose? I don't know, the Artar's taking forever trying to make herself look pretty and she practically dragged her feet. Yeah, no idea what that's like. Artard? I don't know, just go with it, man. So tell me what really happened to your eye. Bye. Bye. Tom. Rose. Nice to meet you. 